This is the Action 5 Pro and one of the new features that it has over the previous models is a night mode feature. In this video, I'm going to show you my little test that I had the other night riding around in the dark with this and I found that, well, let me just show you the video. Let's jump in. So this is the Action 5 Pro. We are in night mode and it's about 9 p.m. at night. Out on the Ultra B, it is very dark out although we do have a full moon. Now with action cameras, the thing shooting in the dark is the stabilization will not work as well. You have to have some bit of light that it can use to get better stabilization. Obviously, the more light that you have, the better stabilization you will have. This is low beam, and that's high beam. So if you are somewhere where you have street lights or if you have some sort of lights behind you, or if you're riding on a vehicle where you have headlights or you have a headlamp, something that will give the camera just a bit of light. So just keep that in mind. If you have some light around you that you can use to your advantage or if you can add some light in, whether it's a headlamp or headlights or some external light that you can add, that will allow you to be able to get better night footage from night mode on the Action 5 Pro because that light is helping to use the stabilization to its best ability. If you don't have enough light, it's just going to fall apart. But here we go. Got external microphone hooked up too. So hopefully you got some good audio. This bike is pretty quiet, so riding around you can hear pretty well. Yeah, a little more view would be nice. It's a little dark. See if I turn this on though. I've got a lot of light up in my helmet, so not the best. This is the way. We're just on a little night mission here. <laughs> kind of just testing out the night mode on the Action 5 Pro. So let me know what you guys think about it. Is night mode... I mean, really what it does just bump the ISO up on the camera which they added I think it's like 51,000 ISO or something which it was only at 40,000 something on the Action 4 so you're getting a lot more ISO which I get it I mean it helps get some more light into the sensor but let me know what you guys all think about it. Just from this sort of test here. Should we hit some single track? I don't know what this will look like. I haven't even checked to see what this footage like. So you all are getting first preview of it. some tight trails in the dark. It's a lot nicer in the day. You can actually see what you're running into. In the night it's just uh, a surprise. And jumped in the water. So yeah guys, let me know what you think about the night mode. Let me know if you want to see any different kind of content. And I think there's something looking at me in that tree. Let's go find out. Just right over here. I 
don't know, should I go over there? Who knows what it was? Oh, there it is right there. See him? It's a raccoon, y'all. So that is a test I did with the Action 5 Pro just to see what I could do with the night mode feature. I found that if you just have some bit of light that the camera can use to get you better stabilization because if you don't have enough light, the stabilization just doesn't work. The footage just doesn't work very well. So you have to have some sort of light in your footage. But let me know what your thoughts are from this test down in the comments below. Be sure to like this video, subscribe if you aren't already, let me know what you want to see next, if you want to see more testing on this Action 5 Pro, what kind of tests I should do, and I'll see you in the next one.